here's a thief coming up to steal my packages off the porch. He comes up to the door and grabs the first couple of packages in the box, leaves one box on the porch, about falls on his face, heads to his car. About this time I'm watching him on my security camera upstairs. So I run down the stairs and I'm going to meet him at the door. Here he comes back and you'll notice when he gets here he recognizes that I'm at the door. So he pauses. Watch what happens when I open the door. He's trying to trick me but I don't let him. Throws a package out on the ground. I go get his license plate number. He peels out. I get everything back. Called the cops. They got his license number, so hopefully they'll catch him. Hey, what's going on, man? Ah. <laughs> Hey. Yes, sir, may I help you? Oh, really? I got you. Wow. Hey. Hello. Yeah. What are you doing? Hey, put that back. Hey, 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 get away. Hey, 
Hey, put that back. Put that back now. Oh, sorry. Put it back. Baby Gracie! Yeah! <laughs> How you doing? I man? love you! I love you! Oh, there's a big kiss. How's it going, man? How do you turn on the kid channel? How do you turn on the kid channel? Yeah, in the how house? do you turn on? How do you turn on the kid channel in the house? Yeah, my, I'm over here by myself because mom led in me. Where? Well, where's your mom at? She's not. You're not supposed to be home alone. She's not coordinating with oh, with, with Alex, and she. I wanted to go home, and she said I could come here and turn on a kid channel. Okay. Yeah. Well, you just gotta press the power button. Press the power button on the side of the TV. You know how to do that, right? Yeah, but I don't know how to what channel to get on to get cha kid channel on. Oh man, I think the kid channel is channel maybe like 25. I don't know yeah. what 25 looks like. <laughs> Get, Come the on. <laughs> Get the remote. <laughs> Get the <laughs> Get the Get the remote. Get the remote. <laughs> <laughs> Get the remote for the TV and then press the number two and the number five when you point it at the TV. That should that should work for you. He was on a chair. Oh, goodbye, but I'll give you one more kiss. Okay, one more kiss. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. I love you. Love you. Bye, bye. Okay, bye, bye. Bye. <laughs> We were sitting here on the couch one evening and Ring Neighbors notified me of some activity. I pulled out my phone and there were multiple houses that evening that posted videos of this woman stealing packages off their porch. To have someone just walk right up to your house and take something, 
to put a face to that action and to actually see that occur gave us the ability to do something about it. Immediately, our fellow neighbors started to comment, this is the same lady that just hit our house a couple hours ago, and then it kind of took off from there. Very shortly after that, the police arrested her and went into her apartment and found hundreds of unopened boxes. Coming up at six, a woman caught on video seen several times in front of Dallas homes stealing packages was actually turned in by her own neighbors. This is the first thing we ask for. Do you have any video coverage of this? That's the greatest tool to be able to take as law enforcement and be able to turn over to a prosecutor to be shown in court. Definitely sharing information with neighbors, even if it is just social network, would be a huge difference. It can only help that connectivity, everyone watching out for each other. The way it brings everybody together and sharing of information and incidents is almost instantaneous. Nowadays, the game has been completely changed. Everyone wants to make sure that their neighborhood is safe.